Full-time in the UCD Bowl, where it has finished 2-1 to visitors Bohemians in tonight's League of Ireland Premier Division clash. Despite a strong start from the, from the students, a goal right at the start of the second half buckled the UCD defence, who were never able to fully recover. The chance of the first half in the, in the 20th minute, Jonathan Afalabi was played in a one-on-one with UCD goalkeeper Lorcan Healy by a wonderful ball over the top from James Clark. With Afalabi beating the UCD offside trap, he set himself up for a shot at goal. Healy was in two months whether to come off his line or not and was caught in no man's land. Afalabi shot was blasted over the bar, which is a real surprise given his form this season. Seven minutes later, Healy made a crucial save from a close-range header for Afalabi again. With Afalabi no more, no more than six yards away, Healy's save was purely reflex as he, hit, as he tipped the ball over the bar. The stubborn UCD defence had only lost for so long, and three minutes into the second half, Bohemians did finally break the deadlock in this game. UCD were caught out of possession high up the pitch, and Bose countered clinically. Afalabi had the ball at his feet just inside the UCD penalty area laying it off to Clark on the edge of the box. Clark made light, light work of a scrambling UCD defence, dribbling through on goal before calmly slotting the ball into the bottom right-hand corner. After a long period of sustained pressure, Bohemians doubled their lead on the 65th minute mark. After an excellent run by Dylan, Dylan Connolly down the right wing, he drove to the byline before whipping in a dangerous cross into the UCD penalty area. The cross was met by the head Danny Grant at the back post as he climbed highest of everyone to flash the ball across the face of goal. His header nestled nicely into the bottom right-hand corner, leaving Haley with no chance of saving the effort. A brilliant late goal from UCD's Matthew Alonge would, would, reduce the def, would reduce the deficit to just one goal, but it would prove to be only a consolation score. Nevertheless, it was a brilliant strike from Alonge, whose shot from distance nestled, nestled perfectly in the bottom left corner. UCD would push for late equaliser as the game opened up hugely in the final few minutes, but were unable to equalise. And Bohemians leave Belfield tonight with all three points, though it was, it was a rather tense final few minutes. Full-time here in the UCD Bowl, UCD 1, Bohemians 2.